Roto Brush is one of the best tools available in After Effects, you can edit any scene, from changing background to taking a person to the moon. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to use Roto Brush and change the background of the scene. For this tutorial I'm using After Effects 2022. Before beginning this video make sure you are using latest version of After Effects. Let's get started. Bring the video into Project Panel. Drag and drop the video into Timeline. In this video you see a person walking. We will change the background of the video by using Roto Brush. To do, just double click on the video. The video is now a new layer where we can edit our video. Make sure you are on the first frame of the video. On the top side, you'll see this icon. It is called Roto Brush. When you click and hold left mouse button on this icon, you'll see two options available here. One is Roto Brush and other one is Refine Edge. We see what Refine Edge do in a minute. Click on the Roto Brush tool. Now you can select the object in the video. Select the object of your interest. Once you select, the selected object is shown in pink color. On effects panel, you see many options available to make changes into our scene. You can select the version of Roto Brush you want to use. I'll leave it to 2.0. You can change the quality of selection. Make it best if you want awesome results. Further you can go to view. In resolution, select full. But make sure you are using high-end graphic card as application may crash. Otherwise leave the options as it is. Let's select the person. If you want to change the size of the roto brush, simply hold control button and move mouse up and down to increase or decrease the size of the brush, respectively. And if you want to remove the selection then hold the alt button. You'll see the green brush turns to red. This indicates you can remove the selection on the video. After selecting the object of your interest on video, you can further make some adjustments to your selection. Feather is for smoothing the selection. Contrast helps to separating the object of interest to the rest of the scene. Shift edge, contract or expand from your selection. Reduce chatter will helpful to track the object when it is moving quickly in the scene. Experiment with these options on your scene for better understand. Now it's time to see what Refine Edge Tool will do. Refine Edge Tool is used to select those objects which Roto Brush can't select precisely. For example, hair, feather, etc. In this case, the person's hair is not correctly defined by Roto Brush. So we will use our Refine Edge Tool to select the hair. To do so, simply click on the area where the hair is present. After selecting your area of interest, now you press spacebar. The scene is process. You see each and every frame attracts the object you selected. If you see any frame where the selected object is out of your selection, then simple stop at that frame and make corrections. This will take time, but the final result will be amazing. Once you satisfied with your scene, click on the freeze button. Now go to Composition Layer, you'll see only the area you selected is present on the screen, all other things are removed. Now if you want you can change the background of the scene. In case anywhere the video is not perfect. Again go back to Layer and unfreeze the scene and edit again. This is only one benefit I have shown you. Roto Brush can do many things which we will know in other videos. If you missed any steps, watch the video again. Hope you find this video useful. If so please hit the like button. Subscribe the channel. And also comment down if you need further assist. Till then take care. See you in the next video.